being able to go from milk cartons to posters to global state-of-the-art tech in that response is powerful. They say it takes a village to raise a child and a community to find one. The new app launched today that helps in those crucial early hours to reunite missing children with their families. I truly believe that if this um, technology existed when Lindsay went missing that we would have found her, we would certainly know what happened. A missing child is a parent's worst nightmare, a nightmare that Judy Peterson has been living for the past 26 years. Lindsay was 14, she would be 40. Um, so two and a half decades ago, we didn't even have really the internet, there was no Facebook, email, anything. So I was going around Comox with my roll of scotch tape and my homemade printed posters and a box of Kleenex. Uh, trying to get the word out. Launched today, the rescue app created by the Missing Children Society of Canada and Ursi Canada gives hope to reunite missing children with their families by harnessing time and information. If you can ask them those questions or draw it to their attention right away, um, they, can, they can give a tip and get some resources where they should be. Downloaded through a web browser, the app is the first of its kind, delivers information to police and the public through images, maps and tips. Officials say allowing the public to provide information from their communities in real time will change the way they locate missing children. As a police officer, as a father, I can tell you that no amount of resources is too many when it comes to finding and safely returning, safely reuniting a child with their, with their family. Last year alone, police responded to over 42,000 missing children cases across Canada, and they say the app ensures that no missing child will go unnoticed. There is a high percentage that are high risk, but again, they don't all meet the Amber Alert threshold. That's fine, uh, but I would argue this is filling a gap. The rescue app allows individuals and police organizations to work together for the first time to find missing children. It's a really big day for me to see everybody's come together to um, put this together for all families. So that more parents don't have to endure the same heartbreak as Judy has, waiting for answers. In Calgary, Allie Miller, City News.